If you're looking to remove or disengage the knife from the Singer Pro Finish Serger, I'm gonna show you how to do it, but then I'm gonna tell you why you never want to do it. So <laughs> I know that doesn't sound very uh, uh, appealing here, but let me show you what you can do. Slide this open, pull down towards you, and the knife here, you notice, will go up and down as you turn the hand wheel and you create a stitch. So there's a blade at the top and a blade at the bottom. Speaking of the blades, they do need to be replaced eventually, probably not right away, but if there's ever a time where it just doesn't feel like it's cut in your fabric, maybe more meshing it, uh, it you just have your local soy machine store, uh, service your machine, let them know the knife needs to be replaced and they'll do it for you. It's super easy. Uh, they usually have those in stock. But when you want to, to get this knife out of the way, you're gonna push in and then just twist on this black wheel and this will bring it up and out of the way. So I say out of the way because I have been known to need a little extra room when maybe putting my needles in and out or even just threading the needles. Now keep in mind, this is actually not sharp, like, like it will cut you, but it is a knife blade. So it doesn't actually cut you unless it's put up against the other blade. Once it's up, all you have to do is spin it around to click it back in place. Now let me tell you why I don't ever take my knife out of position. So when you're surging along and that knife cuts, it cuts off the fabric right here. So some people are like, but what if I don't want it to cut? No problem, all you need to do is guide the fabric right next to and watch the knife. You can come in and just let it be your guide. It's my visual guide. So if I am taking it out, two things are gonna happen. Number one, I have no idea where that guide was. So now, if my fabric gets a little too far to the right, you have moving parts. The upper looper comes up and over the presser foot. So if your fabric is going in and it hasn't been cut off, that upper looper will come in and stab this fabric at a very high rate of speed, by the way. And now you have other issues because if you don't realize you did it, you'll probably break that looper off and that's not covered under warranty. So if I had left that knife down, I would have had a guide to follow and I would have cut off the fabric that might have snuck a little bit off to this side. So again, I use it as a guide and I eliminate having a trip to my service center by making sure I never accidentally get too far to the right and not realize it before I damage the serger. So keep it down, you'll be fine without um, cutting off anything if you just use it as a visual guide along the edge of your fabric.